Okay, so, the PAX panorama is now over, PAX is said and done, I'm at home, can relax again, and play some more weird games. We are here tonight for Random Game Night 41. We're opening up tonight with one of my PAX souvenirs. In fact, I only got two games, and this is the only one I can play, and I'm getting no sound. Thank you very much, Elgato, I should... I guess I should... Oh, no, I am. Never mind. I'm just crazy. But it's done. Done. The other game I got, if you saw Twitter, you would know, is Learn with Pokemon Typing Adventure. However, my DS, for the time being, is out of commission. So this is really the only, the only other option. I mean, I guess there was Star Fox Zero, but I, come on, we have to play a weird game. That's just the way this goes. Game saves automatically. Based on the demo that I've been watching before the stream, this seems to be straight up something like a uh, barn. I'm gonna turn that down a bit. It's not super low, well, but this just seems to be straight up barn 64. Oh, move a weird scientist guy. Very, uh, interesting. White Bomber, I'm sorry, but there's an emergency assignment. There's an unknown planet heading for Planet Bomber. Investigate immediately. We're on our way there now. We'll keep in contact. Good luck, Bongo Bongo. <laughs> Be careful. Okay. Yeah, we have to absorb this in. This terrible voice acting. If those rockets aren't destroyed, the dark star will crash into Planet Bomber and pulverize it. What? Oh. Forgot how bad Bomberman's voice actor was. Oh my god. And I thought Mega Man's voice actor in, in uh, not six, eight was bad. And if you saw the Twitter post beforehand, since I was talking about packs, um, I uh, was transferring some files before this stream. I was transferring the Throne Controllers files, so if I have time after this, like after the stream, I'm gonna get that edited. If I don't, then I'll just edit it and post it tomorrow. And it will, if I end up having to post it tomorrow, it will be posted first, then this footage. So I'm sure there's a lot of people who want to watch the Throwing Controllers panel. I have to still see because... So, I kind of am not really a fan of my phone right now because... So, story time. Well, I, mean, I can also unplug it, I guess, since I'm done transferring the file. So, story time. And there's two parts to this story. First off is my Throwing Controllers losing footage panic attack. Because, uh... It's me, Dr. Ein. This is it the first time I've recorded a Throne Controllers panel with my phone. You I used a straight-up video camera in the past. So I tried this method, bomber. and uh, I had a bit of a panic attack when I found out that uh, it only recorded half the, half the panel. But I found out the reason why. It's because it's split into two different videos for some reason. Don't know why... But it is what it is. But then there was when I was trying to put those files up. Because I was going to put those files up a few days ago. But here's the problem. I uh, was having some... We'll, we'll just say technical difficulties. I... Uh, for some reason... Samsung... Because I use a Samsung Galaxy S6 for those who don't know. And, if, and now you do know. It is a uh, oh, you're an you're straight an enemy. It is crap with transferring files, man. Cause I tried to transfer files, like you you'd assume like you plug in your phone and then it detects the phone. You can transfer the files, and it used to be like that. It isn't anymore for some reason. 
Uh, I wasn't. Okay, that's how I tra change the direction. How? How do I throw things? Oh, like that. Duh. But uh, now I've lost track of what I was saying. I'm smart. At least we did that. Okay. Trent. I, now I have to go back and think, like, what was I talking about? Because this always happens. I know it's something about a Samsung and it being shitty. Because I tried the transfer files. It did not read the phone by default, which was already stupid in and of itself. So I take it to the... I head down to the phone store today. Take it to the guy, because, like, uh, he, he'll probably know what to do. It takes him an hour to figure this out. And this is just to transfer media files from my phone to my computer. It is so stupid. It is by far the dumbest experience I have had with any phone ever. Though I guess that's not saying much considering the fact that I barely used my old phone because it was a piece of shit. But still, my point gets across. It Use is the dumbest. To big objects. You can make a big bomb by lifting a bomb over your head. Okay, and throw it. Now I'm supposed to do. I guess so. All right. What else is? Oh, well, there's another chance for power ups. If I could get a bomb kick, that'd be great. Do I have a bomb kick by default? Yep, I have a bomb kick by default. Never mind. I don't know what I'm talking about. God, the 3D-ish part really throws me off. Let's do that. Maybe that'll kill all these guys. Yeah. Except I assume, like, if there's some sort of scoring system at the end of the stage, I'm not sure if there is or is not. I assume it's based on how much health you have at the end of it and how fast you clear the stage. Maybe the amount of power-ups you pick up? I guess I'm gonna find out the answer to that. Hey! Dirty trick. Oh my god! What the shit was that? Oh, I think I get it. Yep. See, it's not a problem when you know what to do. Okay, so Carabombs, abilities, help you in times of trouble. Do not mean to kick that bomb. Right, yeah, I'm, I'm still. Re I will really say I'm recovering from the Pax Panorama. So much as I am recovering from the phone nonsense. Because that is a thing that should not have been a thing. And I still don't know why it was a thing in the first place. Oh, that's a another set of respawning enemies now, is it? Nope, nope, nope. God, 3D borrowing games can sometimes be weird. Oh, that's a dick move. And this is clearly a well-designed game. Oh, thanks, game. Oh my god. No. Okay, it has to be something to do with going up here. It's the only way we haven't gone yet. And sure enough, looks like I was on the, the right track. Did that do anything? Okay, it might be store some power, then throw. Is it? Nope. But I think I blew myself up in the process. So good on me. Maybe it's throw out of this thing. Nope. Okay. Cool. Oh, maybe it's this. Since I might need a little bit more. Oh no, that was a good enough. Okay, I I can kind of get behind this game. I mean, I personally haven't played Barman 64 because I've heard that one's really good. Well, 
Bad statement. I play it once at a tournament. Surprisingly, won the tournament, and that's all my experience with Bomberman 64. See, so yeah, I guess that was a bit of a bad statement on my part. Okay, now we can go in the water. Where does this get us? Not even I know. We can go here. But where is here? Well, we haven't blown these up, so I think we can assume here is a new area. Bananas, strawberries, who knows what they do. Actually, I was a betting man. Yep, looks like they give experience to our uh, our character. Because it looks like we have some sort of level up mechanic. We'll take that. All right. I get. I'm. I think that thing that we just picked up is actually like a max life up. Okay, can't go that way. I can lay down bombs in the water. Not like that's gonna do me much good. There's something this way. Make everyone sick. Alright. Um, staircase here. And we can go through. Honestly, I thought I was gonna get stopped. Okay. Hate these enemies. Give me food so I can level up my guy. I'll take another bomb. Items around here are food for the char bombs. You can take the food, the char bomb. Yep, became and Kara bomb. Excuse me. But we should be getting to our level two. Wait, what? What is this? I moved the C stick, the C stick, and that's what happens. Is he hella? All right. All right. I'll also go in here. Looks like we're in an icy area. More bananas. Hi. Hey. Strawberry. And that should be enough to level up. Can now go against the flow of water and we can swim. Okay, that's actually kind of a cool way of leveling up. You get new abilities each time you level up, which not very different from RPG now that I think about it. I guess I always like going with the not thinking about it route. So, let's go. It also probably means in due time, we're gonna be putting used to, hey! Hey, give me back my, Never mind. guess I'm not getting that bomb. All right, let's give him the boot. God. Okay, running past these guys. And you. Go away. Don't want to be bothered with these guys, but they're not going to give me much of a choice at this rate. Okay, let's at least take out one of these houses. We don't need enemies spawning 24-7. That's not the kind of trouble I want to go through tonight. Oh god, I always forget about that. <sighs> uh, I think we're gonna need some more power. Come on, come on, thank you. Okay. Carefully, area boss. Oh, great. We have to go through an area boss as well. What do we have to go through? 
Oh, great. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Ah, oh, boy. You know what? It might be in our best interest to just lay bombs down randomly and hope for the best. You never know, maybe it could work. I mean, it's not working too badly so far. Fine, hit, get hit. Nope, you're not gonna get hit. That's good. That's fantastic. Oh my god. There's no way I give myself a sudden burst of speed, too. Alright then. Only my bones were remote control power. That would help. Oh, right, I forgot. I totally have the ability to kick bombs. That didn't even occur to me. I must be impressive levels of stupid. But even so, this guy does not want to die. Oh, never mind. I just landed another hit on him. So now we're one full heart to one full heart. All right. Oh, never mind. He's got three hits left. This is the dumbest way to do this, but it works. Okay. Two more hits. Maybe. Want to throw me a bone, game? The game does not want me want to throw me a bone. Wait, is he changing his attack pattern? Oh, no, he's not. He, he's just underground for a while. A lot longer than I thought he would be. Oh, we got him. And I guess that means we're at the end of the stage. I hope. Take us out of here. Area cleared. Thank God. All right, so I think we got our enjoyment out of this game, but we're gonna close off Bomberman Jetters with a battle. Always have to do something like that in a Bomberman game. I mean, why wouldn't we? I don't see why not. One human, three computers. I think we're good to go. Uh -oh. uh, Post packs fatigue, I think, is already starting to set in. Ignoring the fact I'm always tired. All right, let's start. Hopefully, getting some power ups. Right, we're going though. Uh, maybe not. Okay, seriously, what the hell? Okay, good. I'll take that bomb punch and bomb throw. Ah, I could have been trapped. Or we can both die. That as well. Well, guess we can try to get the computer parts on our own. Not like it's gonna ultimately do us any good. Okay, really? Why didn't he bomb punch before? Okay, there we go. Super Revenge isn't on, so I don't get back in the game, unfortunately, but hey. Okay, let's try to get a little bit luckier with the uh, item draws. The last time our item draws were complete garbage. Okay, that's a much better start. Bill, you do that. Damn straight. Speaking of Bill, you do stuff. Um, let's go take out this bomber guy. Ah, almost.
Ooh. Uh, okay, thank God. I was really worried that was a bad idea. Oh, hey! Thanks, buddy. I win! So it's one match for me. One for AI number one. AKA player two. Now if we get a, a bomb punch or a bomb throw again, then we would be sitting pretty. Bomb punch! Thank God. But I still don't have the ability to place down multiple bombs at once. That is the ability I need. Okay, right, let's... Oh, bomb throw. Whoa, God. I almost made a huge mistake. Uh, this is gonna be... It's gonna be hard to trap somebody at this rate. Oof. Whoa, what the... Oh, I have the explosive diarrhea. No wonder. Or at least that's what I call it. Okay, let's grab some power-ups. We're gonna need them. Oh god, oh god. Nothing about this is okay. Nothing at all. This is gonna end in a draw at this rate, isn't it? Oh god! Oh my god! What the... <laughs> What the hell is this? Ah, we clearly have the advantage. But it's the AI, so getting them trapped in this situation is going to be impossible to do. It sucks, but that's the reality. Ah. Something like that is literally my only option. Uh-oh. Yep. Here we go. Woo, God. Well, I think it's safe to say at this rate, this is going to end. Oh, God. Oh, this rate is ending in a draw. Ah, I almost had him. Come on. Get to a point where I can get you trapped. And we will be A-OK. -okay. <laughs> Come on. I looks like we have a draw on our hand. Oh yes! Wow, that match took a while. One more, one more and I win. Still, so let's get to it. Alright, at least we've already got the ability to place multiple bombs. Skull, no. Fuck no. That's actually the reason I had explosive diarrhea beforehand was because of the because of the skull. Let's get something over here. Am I gonna get something? Oh, oh, bomb punch. And on top of having bomb kick. Uh oh, we're we're getting ourselves into quite the situation again, aren't we? Whoa, God! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! No! Oh my God! That was that happened. Ah! Here we go again. Never mind. I have no idea what just happened. Something definitely happened. Alright. Let 
Not getting the power-ups I need, game. Oh, that's better. I'm not stupid enough to go... Oh, my God. Ah, I could have had blue trapped. Never mind, I still trapped him. Thank God. It's getting hard to trap me as well, considering... Ow! Oh, that's good to know. Get hit by a... Oh, my... Whoa, God! What the hell was that? What the actual shit was that? Alright, well... My assumptions what happened was one of the AIs picked up a skull, and because I ran into them while they had the skull, I got infected with what they had, so I had super hyper speed. Fan bloody tastic. Alright. Well, now Red's also one victory away from winning. It's also weird because I, whenever I play this game with friends, we always turn the skulls off because nobody likes the skulls. Um. All right. Well, I got him out. I'm gonna want the bomb kick and fast. All right, we're we're gonna be okay for now. So let's start grabbing. Oh god, not again! Okay, black's gone. Cool. Then let's help ourselves to some power-ups. Or I could just sit around and let the AI duke it out. I claim victory. Now I get my sweet parade float. And what happens that I never get this. I never understood how this works. S start then. Um okay, so we have to dig. I get that much. I never get the point of this mini game. What is it supposed to be for? I guess it's to get upgrades for the next game. Like in the next game, I start with a speed up. I guess. I don't get it. Like. If that is what it is, then it would make more sense for that to be at the start of the match than at the end of the match. Oh well, it's weird, and I think I'm feeling pretty done with Bomberman Jetters, so let's switch to the random game generator.